Okay, so what I'm going to do right now is to measure the EMF on a 5G signal. So as you can see on screen, um, we have a 5G signal, weak but somewhere there. So what I'm going to change um, right now is I'm going to change the antenna. Just bear with me a while. Yep, this is the EMF antenna. Agos X Y Z three Traxel. Let's put it on. So this is a USB. This is where um, the ROM will be read for antenna corrections. Just plug it into the side. And type connector. So because there's a ROM built in uh, with all the corrections, first thing first, we have to go to system. Sorry, system. Utilities USB antenna, import antenna. Right. So this is what we want to see. And then serial number should tally with uh, what we have here. So once we've done that, so as you can see, um, it's not meant to build as I mean, it's not meant to be used as a normal antenna. But anyway, um, let's go to first of all, let's go to spec can mode. So according to RFC, um, the only way and uh, the only options that you can use with the um, this track so in spec and mode is with channel measurements channel power so this way we can turn it on sum of all and so this where um, how we compare to the market the third party devices so a lot of it in the market is a wide band detector where you can just cover the whole frequency range but for field fox we can uh, focus on the frequency that we want so let's look at uh, 3.585 gig which is the um the spectrum for uh, 5g signal here in australia so center frequency 3.585 gig Oh, sorry, what I did just now this let's look at hand no, 20 Mac just for the sake of trying. So you can't see any um, signal here because I haven't turned on the um, amplifier. Let's do that. Uh, preamp on, yep. So as you can see here, so there's a selection of uh, different parameters, different unit that you can use um, in EMF measurements. So let's go by the default, dB microvolts per meter. And yeah, one more thing that uh, we have to do, make sure that uh, the correction is applied. So this is where we go to uh, measurement setup, oh, sorry, amplitude, more corrections. So you can see that change if I turn it off and do it. So this um, applying what's being seen on the antenna being characterized. Okay, let's go back to um, where we turn on the preamp. Uh, let's turn off the antenna and hopefully we should see something there. Mm. Yeah, there's, there's a bit here. But anyway, that's how we get it uh, in, in channel power measurements. So let's go to OTA, um, 5G over the air measurements. So this is another option where we can use uh, fully utilize this uh, EMF. Let's go to 5G NR. Let's try to find the 5G signal um, on the other video that we have is that um, we do show how, how to get the 5G signal. So let's do all over again. Um, first of all, 
go to OTA and then in OTA we go to 5GNR and let's start somewhere like 3.585 gig so this is a Taoshua signal um, I think it's about two kilometers away the base station okay once we get that we can see it it's normal and let's go to measurement setup more SSV offset, offset detections let's turn it on let's narrow down the bandwidth to 20 meg just to speed up that uh, measurements and before that let's turn on the uh, preamp and let's turn down and let's wait okay uh, we continue on um, as you can see I already changed place because uh, the previous that area doesn't have enough power for the detections so once you grab this go to setup result copy SSB frequency and then we go back to turn off that uh, SSB detections and there we go so as you can see right now it's still measuring the normal power so if you want to turn on that um, EMF measurements this is where we do it so just bear with me about uh, um, oh, come on. Yep. oh here EMF so it's under measurement setup more EMF on on yep so you can see right now let's zoom in a bit there we go so I'm still holding this and you can see that the measurements is in um, EMF unit so that's it so that's the easiest um, setup in such a way and the reading is about 43 dB microvolts yeah, this is quite low Let's change that to volt per meter and according to spat we can't hit more than 0.1 volts per meter and there we go we don't get anything yay safe right continue on with just now right Signal still detected in 5G, 5.3.585. Uh, Actually, this the yeah, it should be 3.58464 gig. So this is a Telstra. So let's look at it in RTSA. Nothing. Yeah, it's way below the noise floor, but yeah, good. At least our OTA is still able to capture it. 